They've got Kyrie Irving. O'Neal is out there with Durant. Then there's Ben Simmons. And it's Claxton in at the pivot spot, manning the middle. And you think about all the anticipation over the last go. couple months. Doris, the regular season is finally here. <laughs> it is upon us. Amen, Kevin. We have been waiting so anxiously for NBA tip-off. Obviously, you're always looking to see the movement of personnel. How well do guys who've switched organizations fit in with their respective rosters? Is somebody now a title contender? So many anxious front offices hoping they made the right decisions. And Simmons has got the ball here for Brooklyn. Irving passes to Claxton. Nice ball movement by Brooklyn. To the paint. Back to Irving. Four on the clock. Oh, good with the triple. Here's Dallas. This game against Brooklyn here, it's their first look at the Nets. And really, this is a team that expects to beat everyone when they step on the floor, but they were only able to split the series last year. You wonder if they're looking to take control of this one early. And when you have more talent, you want to keep the other guys from gaining any confidence. And so it's the Mavericks getting on the board first. Shoots. And Irving with the basket on the assist by Simmons. Well, Kyrie Irving has played with LeBron and Kevin Durant. You learn how to operate without the basketball. And, and Simmons is an asset in so many ways. Maybe most of all, his defense. Well, unequivocally, Greg, this guy can guard one through four. And I'm going to say because of the length and the strength he has, in a pinch, he could also guard most fives. He's terrific on the defensive glass, and he can put a ton of pressure on you in his transition game. Like, this guy is a special talent. Here's Doncic. After the made shot from KD. Moving against Dinwiddie. It doesn't go for him. Good D by Irving. Boy, just one for four. A little brisky right now. He feeds it to Durant. It's rebounded by Doncic. For Dallas, they've gone just one of four to get this game started. Dinwiddie outside. Over Irving. Again, the miss by the Mavericks. Yet another miss. Just one for five. Not exactly an ideal start. Ben Simmons gets the bucket. That Kevin Durant with a nice feel right there. Just lead the guy to the open spot. That is beautifully done. They need a good offensive possession. Yeah, they've gone a long time without a bucket. And McGee kicks to Dinwiddie. There's the screen. Here's the three. That doesn't go either for Dinwiddie. That's leading by four. Right side, Simmons. That shot off. And the Mavericks going the other way. Now, here's Doncic. Last game we saw him score 32. Here's Dinwiddie. McGee trying to break free. Dinwiddie with the bucket. Just setting the tone with an aggressive move to the rag and, and where's the help defensively to me that's a complete lack of communication on that side of the ball these guys need to be talking to each other now here is Irving well you think about a team that was as heavily laden with talent as the Brooklyn Nets were when they had Kevin Durant Kyrie Irving and James Harden but obviously injuries played a part the trade, the big trade happens. A lot of bumps in the road for a roster that looked built to contend. Shoot two. The first one falls. If you listen to other NBA players, Kyrie Irving is one of their favorites to watch. He has as complete an offensive arsenal and as pretty a game as there is. Here's what Brooklyn's going with right now. Sharps checked in for Nicholas Claxton. Harris comes in for Kevin Durant. And Thomas subbed in for Ben Simmons. And that one goes in. Two from the line that time. And that's the norm for him. He's pretty much automatic when he's at the line. Nilekina passes to Wood. Here's Nilekina. Back to Wood. And 
finished off by Wood. It's so obvious Nilakina is a pass-first point guard. This guy is an exceptional passer with very good vision. Despite the Nets shifting lineup stores, they're still fairly dominant. Well, that's a credit to their organization. You have to be able to push aside the drama, shut out the noise, and when the ball is tipped, just focus on the game right in front of you. Now here's Powell. Pass to Wood. Now the dish to Hardaway. Over Thomas. He nails it, and we're tied up. Well, don't get caught up in the long-range shooting. Hardaway Jr. has that in-between game. Really nice shot. Irving finds Thomas. The Nets working the ball around now. Sweet little floater. He knew what he wanted to do all along. The teardrop. And that outstanding drive and finish brought to you by Mobile One. And you've got to love the aggression that he had taking it to the rim there. Sets the tone in a close game like this one. 105 left here in the opening quarter. Wood a screen on Irving. Here's Nilakina covered by Irving. Here's Finney Smith. And that won't go, missing the go-ahead bucket. Harris outside. Thomas against Hardaway. The 10-footer. And the basket good. A bank shot that time. I mean, it's just fun to sit back and enjoy watching him operate. And that's what it looked like the D was doing as well. They're just sitting back and watching. We've got a nine-second difference between the shot clock and the game clock. Inside, has to finish Smith. Here's Neelik here. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. Well, for Frank Nilakina, to me, it's about being aggressive. When he's taking the initiative, he forces the defense to react. It's his first trip to the line. And, and over the course of last year, he was up over 90%. And with a stroke like that, you see why. And he knocks down the first one. Frank Nilakina brings outstanding size to the position. It's about playing with confidence and playing under control on the offensive end. He's perfect from the line this time. Mills looking it over. Edwards with the screen. And Harris wide open. He shoots. So at the end of one quarter of play. First shot. They're going from good to great. Boy, what a season 2022 was for the Dallas Mavericks, making it all the way to the Western Conference Finals. Obviously, the huge upset over the Suns turned that season into what was a dream run early in Luka Doncic's career. Durant is the four, with Claxton playing the five. Simmons is out there with Mills, and it's Edwards in at the three spot. So that's the lineup for Brooklyn. Reggie Bullock, he's checked in for Hardaway. The Nets with the lead. And with the Mavs, a trip doors to the conference finals puts them ahead of schedule, many people think. Yes, Kevin, but I don't think you can let that momentum you built last year fade in any way. You've got to keep your foot on the gas pedal. We know how fragile success in the NBA is. You've got a top five player on your roster. You have to make sure you're taking advantage of opportunities. And Doncic hits it to go. Doncic has got his second basket of the game. Boy, Luka Doncic excels in the two-man game. You handle the rock with perfection. Nicely done, young sir. Durant can't connect from 13 feet out. The Mavericks shooting about 42% so far. The three for Doncic. Brooklyn with the rebound. 
And the great shooters know when they've got enough opening to go for the three. I didn't think it was a bad choice on that possession. Now here's Mills. Still looking for his first bucket in this one. Durant kicks to Mills. Six to shoot. With the drive. Here's Claxton. Marvelous lead pass, and he throws it down. Hottie Mills is about winning, guys, but that means finding the open man, he'll do just that. Now, Doncic. Dinwiddie right side. Fires from deep. That shot, no good. So Brooklyn will take it the other way. Up next for him, the Grizzlies at the FedEx Forum. And that'll be the first of a two-game road trip for him. Good on the three-point shot. You allow Kevin Durant space from three, he will make you pay. Here now is Dinwiddie. After the three-pointer from Katie. Simmons against Doncic. And that one drops. Doncic has got six points. And home court advantage can give teams a huge lift. Greg, how different is it playing in front of the hometown fans? Uh, it's huge. I mean, they give you energy. You, you don't want to let them down. So you tend to dig a little deeper when you're playing at home. You will not see this guy miss many of those. He's one of the keys to their floor spacing. Back to Dinwiddie. Dallas needs to get off a shot. Launches it. And it's Doncic missing. Brooklyn leading by five. And here's Mills. This game he had ten points. Passes to Claxton. Brooklyn needs to get off a shot here. Three-pointer. Out of bounds. Dallas takes possession. Let's see what the Brooklyn Nets have coming up. On Monday, they'll be facing Stephen Adams and the Memphis Grizzlies. Then on Wednesday, they'll be facing Drew Holiday and the Milwaukee Bucks. And a little under three and a half minutes elapsed in the second quarter of play. Guys are looking for a spark here. Yeah, a cold stretch offensively, for sure. Here's Doncic. Rebounded by the Nets. Durant's got four rebounds in this game. And never say never, but we might never see another player who combines the length and guard skills of Kevin Durant. He's a player who completely breaks the mold. And defensively, they are on their heels every time the ball comes inside. And so Doncic will bring it up for the Mavericks. They trail by seven. One fifty-three left to play here in the second quarter. Here's Nila Kina. The pass to Pop. On the wing, Hardaway. McGee is screen on Irving. Hardaway finds McGee. And even after two offensive rebounds, they just can't get the lid off. Nets leading by seven. And Kevin Durant has talked about the big 15 for the Nets. But, of course, depth has been a concern. Yes, but Kevin, give Kevin Durant credit because he understands that he cannot win a championship by himself. An organization has got to manage payroll with big contracts and then find bargain role players. It's going to be a key to achieving their goals. And maybe that'll trigger them impossible not to get pumped up after that. Well, you can see the immediate reaction of the guys in the bench. They are pumped up. Now here's Simmons. And then Sharp with the dunk. This is why you love Ben Simmons having the basketball in his hands. Such a good decision maker. There's a good screen. Here's Mila Kina. Sinks it from just inside the baseline. Brooklyn's gone one of four from three-point range in the second. Not a whole lot dropping out there for them. Irving with the ball. Hardaway picks him up. Bucket is good. Irving's got the lead back up to nine now for Brooklyn. They're getting on a roll inside. Their last three field goals have come from the paint. Pass to Powell. Oh, 
That one's in his first bucket of the game. He's one for two. That's about great concentration. Dwight Powell under the rest of the defense finishes nonetheless. Here's Irving. He's got eight. Launches a three. And so it's Brooklyn. Bringing the quarter to a close with a seven point. And we hope you've enjoyed the broadcast so far. We're halfway through the game. Getting underway in the second half. Here's the five for Jason Kidd. The backcourt pair will be Doncic and Dinwiddie. Inside four. It'll be Finney Smith and McGee. And it's Bullock in at the small forward position. Kicks to Dinwiddie. Doncic outside. Back to Dinwiddie. Six on the shot clock. Pass to Finney Smith. And here's Doncic from the arc. Rebound, Brooklyn. And there have been some terrible shot choices here, Kev. That's not a good look at all. Well, technical fouls have been an issue for Luka Doncic since he entered the league. First of all, you love his passion. But I think we've seen real progress in this regard. And that's because you understand if you're Luka Doncic, you need to play high minutes for your team. And this is a shot he can definitely make. And the defense not a factor at all. Pass to McGee. Back to Doncic. Always going up for the alley-oop here. And the burst of quickness on display with the mobile one drive. And putting that pressure on the rim. That's what it's all about, threatening with that attack. And so it's Irving. He brings it up for the Nets. Leading by five. Right around a minute and a half. Played here in the third quarter. Simmons with it. He kicks to O'Neal. And it's good assisting on the play with Simmons. O'Neal's got his first points of the night. Their first basket in four tries. Let's see if that basket gets them going. It can be contagious now. Here's Dinwiddie. Cans the 12-footer. This guy has been elite as a passer since he entered the league. He takes pride in making the guys around him better. And the pass to Irving. Count it. That's 10 points for Kyrie Irving. What a terrific play by just a tremendous all-around player. This guy makes it look easy. Doncic against Simmons. Then Witty surveying the floor. Over Irving. Then Witty's shot is off. A good board there, Kevin, but overall they're getting slightly out rebounded. Bobbed up there for Durant. Up high to stuff the alley -oop. Boy, KD gets himself right to the rim. Lift off is complete. The three for Dungeon. And it's Durant with the rebound. KD's got his fifth rebound in this one. Pass to Irving. chance to extend the lead to double digits but it's no good boy the wheels have definitely fallen off in this quarter he cannot buy one the mavericks ga have been trying to tighten up their defense the past few seasons and it's beginning to show and we're seeing signs that the players are getting the message they're spending more energy at that end of the floor and that's essential for any elite team now here's durant after Luka at Anchich's miss, Durant, the pass to Claxton. It's JaVel McGee with the rebound. McGee's got rebound number five here tonight. Doncic finds McGee. Back to Doncic. McGee sets the pick for Doncic. Drills it from outside. Doncic has got nine points. It doesn't seem to matter where Luka Doncic is on the floor. His shooting ability is impressive. Powell with the steal. Finney Smith passes to Hardaway. 
And there's a minute 45 left in the third quarter. On the wing, Doncic. He's got nine. And you watch the way Doncic runs this offense. He's become a master at the pick and roll. Incredible to see someone run it to perfection. And with Doncic in the pick and roll game, he's so good at such a young age. It's amazing how well he reads the defense. But he can also freeze the defender or create confusion Take with that right. hesitation. Right. He has all Two the stops. tricks to run it. First free throw is good. Luka Doncic has already established himself as a perennial candidate for MVP. He controls the game with the basketball in his hands. He is an incredible driver, and he makes the game easy for the guys around him. Good on both. 137 left to play in the third. Here's Sumner. Pass to Durant. To the inside. Short. And then short with the dunk. And, and although an undersized center, more than making up for it with some serious hops. Powell, this is to Doncic. And they double up Doncic. Outside Hardaway. The high post shot. A rebound by the Nets. Maybe he rushes that just a little bit. Who knows? But he couldn't have gotten a better look than that. Passes it to Sharp. Nice ball movement by Brooklyn. They get it back. Good work there as it goes. And now it's an eight-point Brooklyn lead. He has created some terrific opportunities for himself and really made the most of it. There's 38 seconds left in the third quarter. Here's Wood, and finished off by Wood. And there's a lot of power behind Woods' dunks. He's not going to get cheated when he takes it to the rim. Hey, yo, what is Durant against Wood. It's rebounded by Doncic. Mavericks trail by six. I always like to hold for the last shot right here. Well, that's great execution if you can do that because it takes any chance of momentum away from your opponent. Just three on the clock. That shot off. And so it's Brooklyn. One more to go. Thanks for being with us as we begin the fourth. And so it's Doncic with it. He brings it up for the Dallas Mavericks. Six-point game. O'Neal is out there with Thomas. Then it's Simmons. Then it's Kyrie Irving. And it's Claxton in at the five down low. So that's the lineup for Brooklyn. And, the, and they're controlling the boards, Kevin. That's plus five in that category. O'Neal misses. Mavericks trail by six. Hardaway kicks to Wood. Dinwiddie outside. On the wing, Doncic. Counted by Simmons. And Doncic gets it to go. There is this fundamental confidence to what Luka does. And those difficult floaters, no problem. Outside, Simmons. Dinwiddie against Irving. Back to Simmons. Five to shoot. There's the pass to Claxton. Near the three-point line, it's Thomas. Second chance shot, and the layup is good. And the Nets lead by six. Yeah, coach's pet peeve there. No box out. And to me, this is a common theme that's running through the league right now. Guys looking to leak out rather than box out. Now here's Powell. Down low. And there's Wood. That's good on the assist by Powell. And they're passing the ball very crisply here. Outside Irving. Carries it from three-point range. You just want Kyrie Irving to keep his foot on the gas pedal. He's cooking offensively. Keep it going. Dinwiddie outside. Loads it up for Wood. Takes the alley-oop pass and dunks it down. 
And, and let the big man eat. Throw it up to Wood, and he'll complete that. Now, here's Irving. Past O'Neal. He dishes it to Thomas. O'Neal against Wood. On deep. And the rebound goes to the Mavericks. Doncic outside. For those just joining us, fourth quarter here. We're just over two and a half minutes into it. Wood is screen on Simmons. Here's Doncic. That misses off the back. Row. Well, that's just inconsistency from him. And it's happened all night, and it hasn't helped their cause. Back to Simmons. Dishes it to Irving. The Trey. It's rebounded by Dallas. Woods got five rebounds tonight. I'll tell you, it has not been this guy's best night, but the teammates have been there to pick up the slack. Love it. And, and here we go, guys. This possession could make or break them right here. Here's Simmons. Woods with the block. And an aggressive block there by Wood. He's not going to shy away from competing defensively. To the middle. And the dunk by Doncic. Doncic has been in this position many times. He may have to give it all right now. Kevin. Okay, David, thanks. Now here's Simmons. Outside Durant. Simmons sets a screen for Durant. Outside Irving. Shoots over Dinwiddie. Hands the 12 footer. Huge bucket from Kyrie. Knows how to deliver. And so Doncic will bring it up for Dallas. <laughs> it allows just seven points here in the fourth. One fifty-eight left here in the fourth quarter. Bullock passes to Doncic. Wood is screen on Simmons. The three for Doncic. Buries the long-range jumper. Doncic has got seven points here in this quarter. Such a club shooter. This guy lives for these kinds of moments and delivers. Basket counts. And the Nets lead by four. I could make the case Kyrie Irving is the best ball handler of all time. On the dribble drive, look out. Here's Doncic following the basket by Kyrie Irving. No good there with this step back J. It's hauled in by Wood. Wood's got six rebounds here tonight. Dinwiddie against Durant. The three for Doncic. That doesn't go either for Doncic. If you want to cut into a lead, you have got to trust your teammates and move the ball. There's the pick. And on the way from Irving for three. That doesn't go in either for Irving. Simmons against Doncic. Wood a screen on Simmons. The three for Doncic. That doesn't go either for Doncic. And now they decide to foul intentionally. A sensational block that definitely deserves another look. And guys, that is lockdown defense at its finest. Going right at the shot and then able to knock it away. And the Nets with possession here. Hanchins with the steal. Really poor pass there, guys. And the deep did a great job capitalizing off the mistake. And you can't get a bigger bucket than that. I'll tell you, it takes confidence to pull the trigger in that situation. You love guys who relish the moment. And so they foul intentionally. the first one, and that makes it a three-point lead. Kyrie Irving 
Bruins history suggests he has ice in his veins. Another opportunity here at the foul line to show how clutch he is. And so he drops them both. It's a four-point ballgame. Yeah, two-possession game now. Pass to Wood. Feeds it to Doncic. Some nice passing here by Dallas. Got it! And what a sensational bucket to bring them within one. There's 18 seconds left in the fourth quarter. And they stop the clock as soon as they can with the intentional foul. Yeah, you, you can't let them hold the ball and just milk those last seconds away. And now the line, shooting two. So the first one drops, and that will put them up by two. Well, Irving isn't the guy I would want to send to the line. He is very comfortable with that shot. So he goes two for two at the line, and it's a three-point game. A bit of heroics at the line right there as he bumps their lead to three and makes things a little easier for them defensively. They get it again. Kicks it out to Dinwiddie to tie it up. Off target from downtown. And an intentional foul there stops the clock. Misses the first one. Boy, he wanted that one to fall. No good at the stripe this time. The second misses also. And so it's Brooklyn who scrapes by with the win. What a show they put on here tonight. I mean, these are those games that feel so great to win, and, and really, it's like a knife in the gut to lose. Uh, you you got to love being on edge of your seat and just wondering what's going to happen. How is this thing going to play out? And now, let's go over to David Aldridge from the sideline for an interview with our player of the game. Hey, David. Thanks very much, Kyrie. Great game. How were you able to have so much success scoring? Just by playing aggressive, man. This is my playground out here, so I just treated it so. I just had fun playing basketball. I'm so grateful to be playing the game that I love every single day. So, you know, and being back home, it's nothing like it, man. I just come out here and just have fun. It's just easy to play out here in Brooklyn, man. We all love coming to the app, man. Thanks very much. Back to you. Thank you, David. Great interview once again. And that'll do it for the first game of the NBA season. For Greg Anthony, Doris Burke, and David Oldham, this is Kevin Arlen along with our terrific 2K Sports crew thanking you for tuning in. And now our New Balance player of the game, Kyrie Irving.